Of good people of the internet. <clears throat> Fucking chair, man. Sazai! Dead intro, back for some more. Fucking drawing, what do you want me to do at this point? It'll be all though. Goodbye Friday. I think like with BMF, we have like such giant hands. I have difficulty to really understand them. I woke up not long ago, like I always do for my stream, to be honest. I like streaming in the morning. I give the people that stream at night a better chance of streaming at night. I mean, I feel now I have like a little circle of people that follows me and I follow. And I try to just stream where they are not streaming. Just cause, really. I need some references. Mostly for his OD. Behima from Usamo. I just want to see the picture really big, please. Right now, he has giant hands. I'm trying to like just do them justice. a bit hard even for an artist like myself you tell me I cannot be perfect oh my god such revelation oh sweet that's my favorite song of them all <laughs> it's called banana animus and then my snip doesn't work today like a freaking Snip never work when it's like, I want to support the artist I'm going to be listening to today. And it's like, nope. And I hate that. If you have question about the music I'm listening, the song and everything, I'll just write it down for you. Even if it's on YouTube. I'll try to think about it. So, what should we talk about today? <laughs> the Oscar? No, not the Oscars, that's for sure. I'm happy for Spider-Man, that's about it. Uh, the rest is really just movie to have and watch. As you know, if you win an Oscar, that just means I can't sell more of that movie now. 
At least this is how I see it. I mean, Black Panther won a lot of the Oscars, which I have nothing against it. I have something against uh, the director of Bohemian Rhapsody, which like a confirmed pedophile that won three Oscars. That is really bad. That, I'm really not happy about it. But you know, I'm just a random person on the internet that gives his opinion <laughs> while drawing some fucking very bullshit. I mean, it's not bullshit, okay? Like, before you're like, oh, no, 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 no. I love drawing. I don't care if it's bullshit or not. I mean, it's pretty. <laughs> oh, God, I love this. Anyway, it doesn't matter. What matter is here now, having fun drawing. I hope that pleasure will never stop. I got a night. I need like a fat reference from Behemoth. But like, all I see on Google is like, the freaking porn, yo. So you might hear a Japanese voice, I'm directly on the wiki of Vmuff. I gotta try to, there he is. The Fatty McGee is so cute. <laughs> Look at him, he's so cute. The belly button is very low. Just gotta clean a bit of the sketch, then I'm the fucking Audi 1000 inking that bitch. I gotta put my camera until it desynced, like it usually do. It does, I should say. Can speak properly and lash. I think that's good enough. Messaging me, probably Monsieur Bear. No, it's Esteban. Shout out to Esteban. He donated six bucks to my coffee the other day. Makes me very happy. Thanks, man, for the support. And it's like the second time I do a shout out to him in the last two days. Well, I did one in my recording and now one today, and I'm gonna post today. That's awesome, love the blue bear. Thank you, long calling draggy. Welcome to the stream. He's a grumpy bear. It is one thing I love more than bears. They're grumpy bears. Like something that is big and like grumpy, it makes them so adorable somehow. Oh my god, that was a nasty banana burp. Like a polar bear. Yeah, like a polar bear. Well, like when you look at a big cat and it's like...
I need some reference for my Shigata also. I'll go to the wiki also, you will hear a Japanese voice. That's actually him. <laughs> I just need like his um, outdoor outfit. Oh. Give it to me. Oh. There we go. We have it. All right. Hope everybody is having a good day so far. I know I woke up like probably three hours ago. Two hours ago. An hour ago? Yeah, probably like that. Something along those lines. You know, this like I've been invited to a Discord server. This is my first experience really on Discord and the server. I don't plan on creating one because I kind of don't like it. I mean, I like the server. I just don't feel like it's necessary. There's plenty of servers already for like artists and something. But I've been invited by young Dawson, if I'm not mistaking his name. Been saying that his stream yesterday was kind of awkward. Well, young, if you come to my stream, it's always awkward. That's made the charm of it. Don't worry, like, not every stream are going to be like the best stream ever. That's impossible. Happens sometimes you're like, oh man, I'm so hyped and have a lot of energy to stream and then nobody talks in the chat or something. Don't sweat it too much, just keep talking, find some subject. Think about like why you like the character you're drawing, the thought process. <clears throat> I mean, yeah, people are there to watch and a lot of people are following me or watching the stream right now. Basically just need a background noise and I'm available, so. I'm totally fine with it. I started my stream in like the ideal that I could provide some background noise for other artists that want to draw and they like to have like a stream or a video Actually happy when people tell me, ah, oh, I use your stream fast background noises. I'm like, ah, oh, cool. It's, really <laughs> it's nice. Please. All right. 
But yeah, yesterday I finally decided to download Usamo. And yesterday, like maybe after two hours in the game, I was like, yeah, I'm done with it. I know exactly where it's going. I don't feel like playing a game like that, really. I wish it was just a story more with a character. That would have been better for me, I guess. You just like... Get all the characters and you just do a story with it or something. Who's there barking at my freaking... Solomon, hello. Do you have a Patreon account to look at? Past artwork or just like a coffee fun? Uh, I don't have a Patreon. I don't really have a place where I can put my old art really. I guess I could start posting on coffee. That would be a better alternative. I got a lot of art. I should really get my head around it and spend an entire day posting everything on my coffee. What do you think? You think it should be good? Actually, the Spice Patreon for artists. Number of time that. Are you coming to Ferno Equinox? Nope. I don't have any. I haven't been to any furry convention. Ever. I'm not invited to any. <laughs> I don't have the money to go either, so. I might be talented, but I'm poor as fuck, yo. I still have the good vibe to drop. Fun fact, uh, well, funny story. One of um, the person I talked with on Telegram thought that I was in a free convention with uh, other artists and he was asking where my boot is so he can commission me there and whatsoever and blah, blah, blah. And I was like, I I'm not there. I'm in Canada, I'm not in the North Fuscon or something. KK was there, KK had a blast. Hello though Major Havoc, how's it going? I do follow Major Ava. Thank you for the stream, uh, the host. I mean, the follow. Welcome. Hope you'll enjoy the stream. Oh yeah, I have a button now that says that. Also, yeah, cool. So I guess I won't need to talk when <laughs> when I'll do the stream, where I just stream without my mic. I mean, I guess, right? I mean, I will always take some time to thank people. I think that's really important. Mostly, like, if people are supporting you, you know, you should always find some time to, like, thank you. If there's too many, you should always say thank you, at least to a crowd of people. Yes, good. 
It's the Goodbye Friday, yo. If you want, you can just put your own music and mute the stream and see me at Bang and Draw. It's usually how it goes. <laughs> my second week doing a uh, goodbye Friday uh, last time I wanted to put the video on YouTube but they were like oh it's copyrighted material I'm like fuck I guess I was listening to music uh, well I mean they said uh, EDM something is blocking the video so I guess uh, uh, Bear Grill and Barely Alive is not allowed on YouTube Though the thing from Monster Cat is allowed, so yeah, dance with the dead, yeah, seven, yeah. I'm not sure for Anamanaguchi, but I put some anyway. I'll see if it's the problem, then I'm gonna delete them from my playlist. It's too bad. I really like supporting them. I know they are an indie band, so I was like, I will take my guess. I don't see like. Any problem with it? Happy Friday! Thank you, Aradas. Welcome. How's it going, man? I met Bangy in a bit of music. Now, speaking of the devil, and I'm an Aguchi. Going good, how about you? I'm feeling great. I'm feeling good. Well, a bit worried, to be honest. Uh, I hate leftover chicken yesterday from like a meal that me and Mr. Bear did, and I think it made my stomach upset a bit. So I'm feeling fine, but just like, I'm just a bit worried. <laughs> I don't want to be pooping on stream, you get it? That's terrible commentary. Ah. Need some references. My birthday's in trade from today. How old you gonna be? Gotta be legal in Canada, that's for sure. No, yeah, except for Ontario. Ontario is like 20. I mean, where I am now in Montreal, in the Quebec section, you need to be 18 to be. Uh, to be buying alcohol and weed. You got yourself stoned. You gotta get yourself fucked up for your 18th birthday. Like I didn't. I really started to get like crazy party stuff like around 20, 22, 23. This is where I'm at peak. Now I'm just tired of it. I'd rather just go to somebody and chill than partying. Except a few occasions. Like some holidays I'm like hell yeah I'm gonna get wasted. But even then I don't because like I have a higher alcohol tolerance now. And then Mr. Bear is also very, very 
tolerant on alcohol, it's crazy. Send Patty soon, so I'm gonna get. I have a feeling that this year is gonna be filled with weed. <laughs> it's, the <only> <coughs> it's the only day of the year when you're allowed to actually drink on the stream, on the street. What am I saying? And since weed is legal now, since last last spring, yeah, I have a feeling that this year uh, Ascent Patty is gonna be filled with weed. I might get like high without even touching any joint. Smoking is not really my thing anymore. Like, I'm no longer a smoker, I should say, but I never really smoked. But I don't have any interest in smoking anymore. Just gotta buy some commission with my pretty money. That sounds cool. I heard you're trying to get chocolate wasted, my dude. Get chocolate wasted? I don't know what it is. Later, then I try to enjoy the channel. Have to get back to work. Thank you for joining Young Cali Dragon. Or I'm Kelly Dragon, I'm just taking Khalid. Have a good day at work. Or well, let's try to. Look at him. Adorable. Let me take some references. I like when like big character has like a shirt that barely fits him. Uh, <laughs> it just like give a little bit of underbelly action. Not like a bird, but I think it's really cute. I'm surprised I'm getting my first um, Usamu uh, like commission next week. Like somebody just reached to me and were like, "Can you draw this character for me?" Well, of course I can. You know, I'm a big fan of Caravan Palace. But the latest clip they put out on YouTube, I was like, not impressed. Not like... I was really kind of disappointed. I was expecting something more movie groovy. And uh, well, there was too many vagina for my liking, if you ask me. No, there's nothing, something wrong with it. I just feel like it was very sexual or something for YouTube. But really, like, Karen Palace video clips are often hit or miss. It's either it works very well or it doesn't work at all. One of my favorite songs of their uh, latest album is called Midnight. I really love this song. But when I saw the video clip, I was like, that's such a boring clip. What the fuck, you know? I wasn't into it. Just like, well, just like guys stealing shit, beating women. I was like, okay, what does he have to do with Midnight? Like this song doesn't fit with what's happening in the video clip. I feel like 
I'll have to get a ref sheet before I get commissioned though. Well, you don't really need a ref sheet really. You just need like pictures. If you have like pictures that shows like your character correctly, I think ref sheets are like... It's really just candy for commissions really. I get asked more and more if I do ref sheet. Badly, I don't. Uh, I feel drawing them will be very boring. I'm not into it. Like, I would do it for a company, I wouldn't do it just for myself, kind of deal. Because when I do, I just draw the character and then add the color on the side, you know? And even then. So I have a friend that does that, I just remember. Like, she loves making it. I guess I could refer her. That makes sense. Yeah, that makes sense, I guess. There you go, our fluffy boy. of this boy. I sent a message earlier to Mr. Bear. I know he's kind of busy right now. Just like yesterday, we didn't text each other like we usually do. So this time I wanted to make sure that I sent him a message saying like, hey, love you. No, I'm looking at the reference at the same time. But like, the way I drew it is not as fat as the way they drew it. So like... It's because we have such different style. 
Like it feels like they are large but corrupt, you know. I just can't do it correctly, I suppose. And who's gonna complain anyway? If you can't then you get banned from the stream. What do you want from me, Roka? Come on the stream. Whoa! Behemoth lost his jacket. Okay, I thought he was naked for a sec. Now he's just wearing different pants. I was like, ah! <laughs> well, you know what? That's actually a good reference, so I'm gonna use that. I'll be right back there, yeah, gotta go something, yeah, you, you can do it, I'm not going anywhere. It's like it's funny when people say that to me, like when I'm streaming. Like I'd just be like crossing my arm and be like, I won't stream until Aradis is back. <laughs> I always have this image in my head, you know, like, I'll be right back. And then I'm just like, ah, gotta wait. <laughs> Not laughing at you, of course, I'm just thinking the situation is always funny. Okay, cleaning up the today. It's Friday, Friday. Gotta get fucked on Friday. And you people remember Rebecca Black? I mean, of course you do. Like, was there really a reason to hate her? Really, she was just like another cringy kid that wanted to be part of the internet, I suppose. I mean, personally, I just feel it was mean to just. Hate her just to hate her, you know? But that's that's only me, I guess. Hell yeah. Sandwiches.
Do 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 do. Trying to think what I can talk about. It feels like at like every stream I'm like, hmm. There's nothing wrong with a quieter stream. Uh, I kind of feel like having a tea right now. That'll be great. He has like giant hands, but tiny finger. I don't really, I don't really know how to. S Always had difficulty with like different hands. Because you look at a hand like that, and it's like I have long fingers, okay? And then I know that it's, it's quite common to draw like huge character with like huge hand but tiny fingers, which is cute. Hey Pangs, what's up my man? Thank you for like the picture you sent me on telegram like at first I thought they were naked you know like I thought like uh, he was naked and everything and I was like <gasps> he sent me porn on stream but no he's just wearing different pants that are white like I think it's still uh... that's an odd choice but you know what it's actually a good reference <laughs> not gonna lie Did I open Telegram on this side? Yes, he is. Okay. Uh, like, I think I'm just gonna leave it open here. And I might actually just do like a... Uh, dispense instead. Cute indeed. Thank you, me, e -book. I'm gonna go make myself some tea. Yeah, his sweat suit is the same color as his fur. Yeah, really. But he's a cutie. Look at him with big paws and stuff. And it's more airy, like it's very good references actually. So I'm just gonna, I'm gonna roll with it and make like sweatpants instead of like, uh, just to celebrate new costumes and stuff. I'll just give you the work in progress. I'm gonna go get myself some tea. I won't be long.
Look at this shit. My camera catched it? Yeah, okay, good. It's a basically French toast. Tea review! <laughs> okay, I will. Whatever. I mean, why not, right? Right? Be, be mobile <laughs> by influence. Well, people seem to be thinking that, but I'm try. I'm trying to just like make Ashigara like jealous because now he has like a, a guy that has a bigger belly. And according to the wiki, they don't really like each other. I realized that yesterday. It smells actually good, but it's a black tea, so I expect a strong taste. I've been like it's brown night. Okay. Wait, is that French toast flavored tea? It is. I'm gonna review the tea. I was like a promotion on a David's tea. I was like, you buy a tree, two of these tea, and the third one is free. And I was like, uh, Mr. Bear took like two different tea. And I was like, what the fuck? So I had to take it. Who knows if it's good or not? But you know, I like drinking tea a lot. The thing is, I have too much. Like, I'm afraid if, like, <laughs> if one day I decide to make a P.O. box, <laughs> like, <laughs> I will <laughs> people will send me, like, sample of these. I mean, no, but yes, like, kind of, whatever. I don't know why I'm thinking about it. I'm so famous, this is why. Internet famous sensationalist, uh, that intro. Avant-garde list, dead intro. That's basically me. Like, there's no crumbs of like uh, French toast in it. It's really like uh, I could go and read the ingredients for you if you want. Usually, they like they find a flavor of with certain spices and. Like I have a, a tea that actually tastes like Reese's Pieces, like peanut butter cups. Uh, there's there's like there's no peanuts in it, if I remember correctly. It's like almond, apple, a bit of uh, cacao, and there you go, you got it. You got a Reese's Pieces tea. It actually tastes very good. I don't know how they do it, but you know. Certain, certain flavor can be expressed by doing this kind of stuff. That doesn't sound bad at all, no, indeed. Like if, <laughs> if one day I can invite you to my place, we'll drink tea like crazy. I 
got so much tea. There was a time in our life, me and Mr. Bear were like going to David's Tea every week and then we were like, wait, we buy more tea than we drink. And then we try to change our habits, but you know what? It didn't work. Oh, he has stripes on this side. Ooh, okay. That's actually really cool. Oh. Good morning, old chap. What's up, my bro? That's Godzilla, my favorite... favorite dab... painter. <laughs> Come on, T. It smells good, smell it. Isn't it? The best kaiju. Yeah, Godzilla is the best kaiju. Are you more fan of the original or the one that it's more like burly? Like, I don't remember in which movie, but there was one where people were saying that he was fat, and I was like, yeah, he looks cute fat though. <laughs> I think in Japan they made like a Christmas tree that's actually Godzilla. And I think that's super cool. I wish I could have that. I wish we could have a lot of stuff in this world. Nice big butts, nice. Thank you, Noir. You Mr. Noxid. Everybody call you Noir. N-O-X, which basically means nuts in French, so like... Don't you worry about my accent. Behemoth. Do 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 do. I really do like the new design, but they had a lot of good design over the years of uh, Godzilla. I suppose so. I think the only Godzilla movie I saw was the one in the early 2000s or slash 90s. Where it's like a female and there's like a lot of... Uh, a lot of like eggs that hatches. Spoiler alert, I'm sorry. I can't stay, I just wanted to stop by and say hello. Thank you Mr. Noxid for joining for a bit. Hope you have a wonderful day. It's Friday. You should go out with some friends. Play some card games. Get destroyed and smash <laughs> like Mr. Godzilla and I did. For those who doesn't know, he's like a, my friend neighbor that I talk about all the time. I only say bad stuff to him though. That's right, I only have negative thing to say to Godzilla. You fucking asshole. <laughs> I was kidding, I love you. Me. Oh yeah, he destroyed me at Smash this face a little bit. <laughs> that was quite hardcore, I have to admit. But there's some time when you play with uh, Mr. Nas McGee. And you're the worst, okay? I'm just gonna say that. I guess playing online with all the people really helped me improve my Smash skills. Even though I haven't touched the game in so long. Well, not anymore, but I mean, before. Anyway, it doesn't matter. The stream is not about you, it's about me.
I mean, Piranha Plant is really the best. My favorite kill of the, the time we played with my other friend is really just to do the up B with Piranha Plant, which is like an helicopter that grabs the person. And I just like killed myself with the other player. And that was actually fantastic. <laughs> Fucking love that. That was priceless. <clears throat> I need to rework his eyes a bit. He's so big. He's so. It's just better for the cuddle, I suppose. He's like a big plushie. Like, let's be honest here. Uh. This spell you cast on me—it's like magic. Get to feel like you never give up, bro. Get to feel like you never give up on me. I don't know, like, where the line starts and finishes, but if I have to guess, it goes like here. Magic, 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 magic. And then he goes to his butt too. Okay. I'll just think. Let's taste the tea. Has a very, very strong smell. I wouldn't say cinnamon. But it has a strong smell. It tastes like a French toast. I'm gonna go back and recurious about the ingredients. Tea review! <laughs> okay. Um, cardamom French toast. I guess this is the smell. Uh, Ingredient, please. There they go. Black tea, cinnamon, lemon peel, coriander seed. Oh, jeez, I just spit on it. Uh, cardamom, 
cardamom. This is all they spell. Okay, coconut sugar, cane sugar, natural and artificial flavoring. Contain coconut. Perfect. It's not juice. It's really not bad, actually. It's really like like a breakfast tea kind of. Yeah, legit. I can see the lemon peel and the seeds, cardamom. You really like pain doré à la cardamom. Yeah, it's cardamom, not cardamom. Anyway, sounds weird. But it's actually a good tea. 10 out of 10, we recommend if you're into black teas and. Yeah, that's it. He really doesn't have like much. Uh... Like his sweatpants like are so tight when he's fat that it's just like. Just a lust. He's just like. Beautiful. Magic, 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 magic. I mean, I've been having so much fun drawing those characters. I feel like their designs are kind of per perfect for some. Like when you look at McCann, uh, his design is very cool. Like adding a nice touch with <clears throat> vine looking stripes instead of just regular stripes that really make a difference in the character if you ask me and then Arsalan I like his beard really there's so many like cool characters in Osamu I even got ex Tiranaman to play the game yesterday we started together but like I I'm done I'm not even gonna give it my ID number thingy to be friends with. Like, I remember playing Pad, Puzzle and Dragon, but then I remember how much I hated it in the end. So, like, I was like, yeah, it's probably going to be like that for Usamo too. So, speaking of, I asked him if he's free for a commission. And I asked him if you could draw like a chibi Magnus from Spyro. He said he will find time for it. It's already paid and everything, so I trust him. He delivered so many of commissions. So many... The, the commission I've been asking. Because I always come back to him for my chibi needs. He's very talented. Everybody should get a chibi commission from x Renaman. Shout out to him. He's an awesome dude. I made a joke the other day saying that he has a better life than mine and I hate myself. And one of the first thing he asked me is like, you want to talk about it? You feel okay? You see how much heart this guy has? <laughs> I told him that was a joke. Uh, <laughs> I can understand that sometimes my joke goes too far. But really, like, he's a sweet dude. When I could summon, the first summon I got was like uh, the big titty, <laughs> big titty uh, RP, I guess. Like somebody tells me that this game is not sexual, I won't believe it. Even like with like the first few uh, during the tutorial, like there's just like perv option, and I'm like, I'm gonna choose them all because I'm like that. If it's an option, might as well choose them. <laughs> and I was like, oh yeah, this is where it's going. I like it. Oh, bird mom. Oh, uh, really? Cool design, though.
Isn't it the songs make you wanna just like lay down at the beach? Let's see if we forgot anything. I wanted to rework his eyes. That, that is true. Thank you for reminding me. Really chill. I love this artist. FM84. If you're looking some old vibes. What we call the new retro, I suppose. Like I won't be surprised if like uh, this kind of sound sounds come back into the mainstream for a couple uh, of years. Because like you, ooh. He has like tiny eyes that are just like black, and the middle is white. What did I did for this one? I just did black spurt, right? Hey, intro, I have a drawing for a commission ready. I just follow the step on Twitter, right? You mean you send me a DM? This is what you're telling me? I thought you left. No, that's not true that left. Yeah, you left. For his, anyway, it doesn't matter. I'm going to check it out, see if I won't take it. What the fuck is going on with my Twitter account? It's okay. Like you, you, you send me a DM, right? I don't see it on my Twitter yet. I guess I'll wait. Oh, how many followers do I have? Ooh, okay. I don't get it, young Khaled. I can't find it. You know, I have to blame like two people that made me fell in love with like a character of Usamo, mostly Pangs, to be honest, and my other bird friend. Yeah, when I think about it, only birds, only bear. That was like, yo. You should draw this character from that ca from that game. And I'm like, yeah, I'll give it a try. And then there's so many. There are so many. It's a very bare focus game, yeah, I'm not gonna lie. I mean, I saw like uh, how the teacher looks like and everything, and I'm like, oh, this dude has a peen. That's probably the silliest hour playing in the mobile game. Um, I don't think I'll play more of it, honestly. I 
I just sent it on Twitter. Okay, I'll check it out. Now. There I go. Now I have a DM for Young Cali Dragon. What's up, my man? That's probably why I couldn't see you. Your tweets are protected, right? Anyway. I should. So, if I understand correctly, you want me to draw like a Charizard? If this is what I'm reading correctly. I tried off and for a few years, and this was finally what I got. No, yes, okay. Well, young Khaled, Cali, young, young, young CD. I'm going to finish the stream first, then I'll come back to you on the DMs. That sounds okay? Thank you for your interest in my commission. Really appreciate it. And don't say that lightly. Every commission I get is like one more meal I can bring to my table. Thank you again. No, thank you. He just gray. Oh, there's one finger missing. up my she got mad I feel like I miss the face shape a lot on this one compared to how I'm drawing now that's called try and error that's called I tried once and it didn't work I feel like I'm more like getting a shape better that's what I meant do 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 and behemoth basically just have like a white shirt I mean what can I do with actually copy and paste it Like I always do, instead of always going back into the reference and try to get the red color. As you see, like, it's gray here, but this is per white. <laughs> Nothing wrong with it. I personally feel like you should never aim for those colors when you do a design, because you never know. Uh, personally, I always go like a bit more on like, uh, either on the blue side, like just a little, just a little touch of blue, light blue. <clears throat> but that's me. Or you go on the yellow side a bit, just, just, just a nudge. Like a very, very light beige. Good vibe Friday. 
Hell yeah. I wish I could raise the volume. Usually like I, I have... No love for Vanta Black characters. What do you mean? It's just because when it's time for shading after that, it just makes the character weird. I'm speaking out of experience. You can believe me if you want or not. I don't care. I love you still. Oh! It's a red stripe and then people. I will have to assume it's not the same purple. Okay, never mind. I was about to color it blue, you know? So this is the same thing the other side. I see. I think it's the same purple. No, it's more blue. It's more blue! Oh, this is one is more magenta. But this one is more people. I thought that was a line that separated it. Or in the end, it's just a red line. I might erase it. Alrighty, righty, righty, oh! I should press the control SEO. How does this side work here? I don't get it. Anyway. Now let's take like a, a deep red. Whoopsie daisy. There we go. No wonder why I thought I was like. Uh... It is a red line. I thought it was like a line art. It's just so like faint. And then we have. But I will assume one line goes here, like this. Another one here. Another one here. Here. red line too much and then we work it the same way I did the first time we're just to do like a limitation
There we go. Get back! I'm ready to be it. Welcome back, my man. We we're gone for so long, I missed you. Good music, number one. Back out of the way. Let's get back here. What? Save. Soon I'll take a break, to stretch, go to the bathroom. I give me another 10 minutes, I guess. And try to unravel the mystery of my Twitter comments section. I like somebody sending me like long tweets. I hope it's not like drama or something. It seems to be talking about Bowser. So I'm scared. Because like I said, the comic that been deleted on Twitter is the one where Bowser goes on a date with Luigi and nothing wrong happened. There's nothing obscene, there's nothing bad, there's nothing, you know. But yet, it's the one comic that brings so much negativity into my, like my, uh, notification. Somehow. And I think I'm just gonna mute. Yeah, I should just do that. What am I doing? I should just mute uh, the comments from that comic. I know I love positive, I love positive feedbacks. But this comic brings so much negativity around it, and I don't understand. It's not so I'm not I'm never aiming to just like piss off people when I post my comics, right? Even my friends are like, what the fuck? <laughs> Thank you, Aradez. Did I put like any filter over him? No.
<clears throat> this end is bigger than this end. God damn it. Okay, I'll rework it when I get back from my break. I'm gonna save. I'm gonna take like a little 10 minute break, 5 minute break. I'm going to the bathroom. Uh, yeah, that's about it. So I'll be back in a few seconds, okay, people of the internet, I'll be back.
All right, I'm back. Get some more tea. What time is it now? There's only five. I barely started dealing with them. Wait, is that a problem? I'm gonna save soon. I'm not too certain of your attention here, to be honest. I mean, I barely started. Like, I'm not even a professional streamer. I don't have many butts or comments or whatever. Yeah, he's there in the sun, sunbathing. Is he really in a comfy place? Doing tanuki things, yeah, chilling and being creepy. I mean, look at this. So beautiful. It's my son. My son.
It's probably the, my favorite things. My favorite things like <clears throat> that I have hanging out on my desk. The Tanuki is one of it, like it's perfectly my favorite. It's perfectly probably my favorite. <clears throat> I just like that my friend took some time to find a tanuki for me in Japan. She was like, I need a tanuki for my friend David. I love the lore behind Tanuki. <laughs> hey, it's the deepest lore, deeper than Dark Souls and Bloodborne. I mean, isn't there like a game that try to make a lore extremely like bigger than Dark Souls, but like fell or something? I mean, I wouldn't be surprised. But I suppose we will see after Shikido. I wouldn't be surprised. Because I'm pretty sure a lot of Dark Souls fans are very like, are expecting something big. I mean, which is good to be honest. I think the first thing the game is doing is punishing you for keeping your old Dark Souls habit, so you'll need to go like I think otherwise it's from what I've heard from other youtubers by the way I didn't play the game I don't really intend on playing it I'm not too sure if I will enjoy it The new game from software, yeah, yeah, yeah. Be surprised if they gave it a 10 out of 10 like with trying like only for an hour <laughs> it's usually how it goes dark soul 10 out of 10 and then like as soon as people fart on the floor they're like well it wasn't in my playthrough so it's a 10 out of 10 for me the thing is like everybody think they can be a critic So like, it's always like, I love it, it's a 10 out of 10, but like, no, you shouldn't just do it. <laughs> I might try it, but never really got into the Dark Souls stuff. I'm a huge Dark Souls fan. I've uh, been playing all the games, 1, 2, 3. 
I played Bloodborne a bit, never finished it, because I don't have a PS4, I was just playing at my friend. Uh, but I, I have the art book, and I actually own the game. Like, he gave me his copy because but I was like, it's too overfine for me, I won't play it. I'm like, okay. No complaint here, free, free game that I can play because I have, uh, don't have a PS4. To the bad Lord, killing all with love. I don't care, you're talking about us. I know another friend who was really into Dark Souls. That's cool. I don't like the PvP that much in Dark Souls 1 and 2, but in 3. It was super great at the time of my life. I was helping and trolling. Because I mean, come on, man. playing online is meant to be trolling at this point. I tried to play Smash online and I really hated it. I was like, yeah, you know what? I don't want to become good against people that just spam the same attack to make sure they win kind of deal. I just gotta play with friends and that'll, that'll be it. We're riding on a pink cloud. Oh, oh. What am I doing? I have references right here. Sweet Mama J. We're riding on a pink cloud. We're riding on a pink cloud. Is it two line or three line? Oh, it's four line. It's even worse. You only like to play with friends? Smash or Dark Souls? I forgot what we're talking about. I have to concentrate on making the pattern okay. Which it won't be because it's too much line for the small detail. I mean too much line for like this 
little space I have. I'll leave it like that. Did the best I can do. Ugh. Let's enjoy a little snack. Game in general. I rarely play alone, to be honest. The last game, the last game I played that was like single player, that I passed and finished was Zelda Breath of the Wild and Mario Odyssey. And when I say pass, it's not 100%. That was cool. Then I played Octopath, but. I put it right in my note, I wanted to just tap my note. Yeah. Then I tried Octopath Traveler, that I tell, I tell that story many times by now. It's too long for my liking, too much grinding. You get very tired of just that formula very quickly, in my opinion. I'm planning on playing GTA with Sova and other friends. Okay. I think I know Sova. I haven't talked to him in a while though. I mean, you know what they say, far from the eyes, far from the heart, I believe. I don't friend, this is how they say it. It's like an, ex an expression that means if you don't see them, you talk to them for a long time, you can just hope that they are doing okay. Wait, 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 I got some new brushes for exactly that kind of stuff. Hell yeah!
That's a neat brush. Ah, yeah, I downloaded so many brushes, I completely forgot about it. Because I've been through mostly all of them, but sometimes I don't see uses for all of them, right? Like, for example, something I was missing from uh, when I was in Photoshop is a star brush. I mean, you look at the sky and you can see stars. I didn't have that in here, but now I found one. It's gonna make my starry star go better and but in the in the same time you don't I don't draw like starry night on every picture so it's normal that some brushes get forgotten got so many man so many You always love to eat sub. Subs are good. I think a little front is ready. Let's go to Ishigiri. Feel like it's more like a B. Don't tell me it's per white. It's not per white. No, no, no. I'm not gonna let it be per white. It's more like on the BIE side, okay? Oh, what happened here? There we go. To be honest, I think once I'm done coloring Ashigara, I'm gonna close the stream and and work on the commissions. You have to add out, it's looking amazing. You have a day and have a nice adventure, bro. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for joining, Arad, as always. Have a good no I'll have a good tomorrow. I'll have a good Friday. Don't just have a good one, just have a good Friday.
Thank you. Don't you worry about me. I'll make sure to have a good 3D. the good lair. <laughs> Have you guys seen how the Sonic freaking design look like? It's not the first time I talk about it on train, but every time I see it I'm just... Why? <laughs> Please cancel the movie since it's not too late. Do you really think it will do good in box office? I'm super worried. Let's cheat, let's cheat, let's cheat. I hope There you go Japanese words And we did it I hope no one will get mad at me for that.
I get... Next. <laughs> Let's say we gotta call it a stream. It's streaming for two hours, probably. Not too sure. Uh, I guess so. Yes. Two hours, five minutes, and twenty-three seconds to be exact. So that's it for me today. Hope you enjoyed this good vibe Friday. I know I did. And it's just me signing out. Goodbye, everybody.